It's update day. Yay. Yeah, I mean, normally it's a Thursday. It's Friday. Hey, hey, get off my case. We're still updating. It's a good update. Uh, we fixed some underlying things. I actually found a perf bug after the update that we'll update next week. Uh, but a lot of these things are us attacking systems that we're going to be updating and getting ready for our November launch of the Anacrusis. Uh, and so that kind of just a lot of stuff falls out of that. So a lot of this is a lot of the audio system stuff because there's a lot of sound stuff we did. There's a bunch of things that just were never working quite right that we spent the time now to work. But you may not see as many gameplay updates right now because those engineers, the engineer, is working on a lot of back-end kind of networking stuff because what we want to make sure is uh, we've heard it loud from the community that they want to be able to play offline single player. Uh, we're a one to eight player game, but that one is important. Once you have two, you've got to be connected to the internet. Hey, I'm, you, this, is, this is the price you pay, man. you got to be connected to the internet. We're not doing couch co-op. Uh, talk about the failure of couch co-op someday. But, uh, all right, so we got to have two people. So you're networked. So once you're there. But there's some people who just want to play solo. And I always remember uh, you from Love for Dead. Uh, they uh, played uh, Nick in Love for Dead 2. Uh, you, Dylan, uh, he uh, played it in his trailer, Love for Dead 1, all the time. And that's where he fell in love with the game and wanted to be part of the project. So... That is a thing we need to support. It's been a long time to get there because there's a lot of systems we have to tear apart and how we think about things. And you have to stack rank. What's valuable? What's like, is it having a online meta you can share more valuable than having players be able to play offline? Like, right, you got you to gotta do these, these, these switches up. And again, if you're a giant company, these are things you should just be doing. When you're a tiny company, they mean you're not going to do something else because you're doing this. So while we want you to play... The, my favorite way to play it is four or eight player uh, versus mode. Uh, you can go down to one player. And that's one of the things we're working on now. And a lot of audio stuff and also been writing a lot of stuff. So it's been a good week. Um, it's been quiet. I keep meaning to update the official Anacrusis account with the story of uh, Lance and all of that. And kind of writing for that character. But really just been uh, super busy. Uh, which was funny. Somebody at PAX ran into us and asked me just like, you know, how many people do you have working on all of this? And then I said the number, and they're like, how? I'm like, yeah, we really like our game. We really like what we're doing. Uh, we talk about that a lot. We talked about that today. Some more of uh, how do we make sure we keep this going and how do we keep functioning? It's a thing when you're a small company you always got to worry about. But yeah, so there is an update today. We are playing it if you've never played before and want to jump in. Um, versus is a weird way to jump in, but you can. Uh, or we can play co-op later. But we're going to first start with a versus game at uh, 3 p.m. Pacific time today. And then uh, play some st other stuff after. Uh, but yeah, it's been a, it's been a good good way to end the week is uh, an update and some verses.